And with me now here is Attorney General Loretta Lynch. Thank you so much for coming in. And yada, yada, yada. Let's talk about some of the events leading up to this. The owner of the gun shop where uh, the Orlando killer tried to buy level three body armor, bulk ammo, several weeks before the shooting. This owner says that his staff saw that the behavior of the shooter was suspicious and they notified authorities. Listen to the, what the gun shop owner said. At that time, he declined any business and he left the store. We had no link, no contact. We had, didn't know who he was, but we did contact authorities and let them know we just had a suspicious person that was in here, which we have been in regular contact with them. And any time any event happens, we reach out immediately. And there was nothing that would come of it. So why wasn't more done by the authorities to follow up on those suspicions that were reported? Well, as the gun shop owner indicated, uh, during the course of an actually an unrelated investigation, they were speaking with authorities, and in the course of their discussions, they did provide information about this individual, whom we now know to be the Orlando killer, coming into their shop to talk about purchases. As was noted, because no purchases were made, no ID was gathered, no identifying information was available beyond the information, which was recorded and which was kept. That is exactly what that gun shop owner should have done, and we thank and commend him for that. He then realized, after, of course, the tragic events of last weekend, exactly who had been in his, sh in his shop and called FBI, and again, we were able to put those pieces together. Because no purchase was made, there was nothing to identify who it was, there was nothing to, to say a name or an address, but, again, we are asking everyone to look back at any contact they've had with this killer and do what this gun shop owner did and report it to he us. He did. He did exactly what you're supposed to do. If you see something, say something. He might not have gotten the ID, but if he was that alarmed that he called the authorities, can you tell us, did the authorities try to figure out who he was? Well, what I can say is that this is all part of the investigation that is ongoing now. Everything that we're learning about this individual is being looked at, is being reviewed. All of the FBI's contacts with the killer over the past years are being reviewed. We're going back and scrubbing okay. all of that. And, and, and all of the FBI's contacts with the killer over the past years are being reviewed. We're going back and scrubbing okay. all of that. And, and, and all of the FBI's contacts with the killer over the past years are being reviewed. We're going back and scrubbing okay. all of that. And, and, and all of the FBI's contacts with the killer over the past years are being reviewed. We're going back and scrubbing okay. all of that. And, 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 and